In today's video, we will practice T's problem two, system of equations. Mandy can buy four containers of yogurt and three boxes of crackers for $9.95. She can buy two containers of yogurt and two boxes of crackers for $5.90. How much does one box of crackers cost? Well, as you can see from the word problem, we have two unknowns. The unknowns are the cost of each container of yogurt and the cost of each box of crackers. When a word problem introduces two unknowns, we are going to do what we call a system of equations. In order to find these two unknowns, we're going to have to have two equations to work from. Okay, the first equation is going to be based on four containers of yogurt times the unknown cost plus three boxes of crackers times its unknown cost with that all equaling nine dollars and fifty nine cents fifty five cents excuse me our second equation will involve two containers of yogurt times its unknown cost plus two boxes of crackers and its unknown cost, which totals $5.90. These are the two equations that are going to allow us to find our unknown costs for each container of yogurt and each box of crackers. Now, be mindful, in the original question, we were asked to find the cost of the crackers only. Therefore, we are going to make it our objective to solve for the y variable first cost of each box of crackers as a matter of fact we don't have to solve for x because the question is not asking for how much the box the containers of yogurt cost so we're going to use a technique in, excuse me in system of equations that we call elimination Therefore, we're going to eliminate the x variables and solve for the y variables. How are we going to do that? Well, we're going to have to eliminate this 2x and this 4x. Now, the only way we can do that is to make this 4x and this 2x turn into a 4x so that they can be eliminated. Okay? How are we going to do that? Well, we're going to keep the top equation. We're going to leave it alone. The bottom equation, we're going to multiply by negative 2. Oops. Okay, when we multiply equation 2 by negative 2, what's going to happen is everything here is going to be affected by the negative 2. You're going to distribute that negative 2 to all of the terms in the equation. So when I rewrite my system, I will have this. I will leave equation 1 alone. Equation 2, because it's multiplied by negative 2, will become negative 4x minus 4y equals negative $11.80. Okay, all I did was multiply every term in equation 2 by negative 2. Now, to continue the elimination technique, I'm going to add all of the like terms together. Okay, 4 plus negative 4 is 0. So I've successfully canceled my x terms. Okay, 
negative 4 plus 3 or 3y plus negative 4y is negative 1y and 9.55 plus negative 11.80 is negative 2.25. Now in this problem guys I'm assuming you guys are comfortable with adding negative and positive numbers okay Now we have negative 1y equals negative 2.25. Okay, so if I take this over here, now remember I have to isolate y, so I'm going to divide each side by negative 1. A negative divided by a negative will give me a positive result. Now remember, we're dealing with costs here, so this final answer I got will be in terms of dollars. So, we have successfully solved for the cost of each box of crackers, which is $2.25. Guys, if you find this video helpful, don't hesitate to like this video and also subscribe to our channel. We will be making more videos in regards to the T6, we'll be doing several more videos on practice problems involving other concepts. And we hope this was helpful and we'll see you in the next video.